Included in your kit you will find two small spacers as shown here. These will attach easily to the front hinge bolts on your skylight. If your skylight still has the small plastic caps over the threads, you must remove those first. Carefully thread them on, taking care not to damage the threads. These are your mounting points for your new screen kit. Your screen, as shown here, will go above the bezel at the front of your bus. Normally just a slight wiggling motion from side to side will put it into place and you will see through the holes that these align with your new spacers that you just installed. The shade toggles, these devices here, you put a bolt through with a flat washer on one side and a flat washer on the bottom side. And then, I'm not going to do it here, but you should put a dab of silicone or nail polish on the thread so that it will lock and not come loose with usage. So when this goes up here, this will thread into the insert and then you should just gently snug it up. You just want a little drag but not too tight. If you make it too tight when you adjust the shade toggles to hold your shade screen in and out, take it in and out, the bolts could loosen and while not as aggravating as your velcro uh, would get old quick. So just snug them up so the toggles turn freely with just a slight amount of drag. And that's it. Your kit is installed. Fits above the bezel at the front. There's a weather stripping all around the outside edge which holds it snugly to the roof. And then your shade panel, which looks like this, then simply slips into place and sits there like that. This is a pre-production screen, so it does have a couple of little boo-boos on it. But rest assured that the kit that arrives in the mail at your house will be as perfect as I can make it in my little backyard factory. And that's it. Your skylight works as normal and no mosquitoes. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy it.